Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Rocker911 and today I'll be showing you guys how to connect your PS4 controller to Steam. So first of all you need to get your PS4 controller out. So here's my PS4 controller. Um, then you're what you're going to do is you're going to connect the connect the USB cable to it and connect that to your computer which seems logical um, then you're gonna notice that the orange light came up so um, so it's on now so let's go um, so here we have steam here we have our little uh, devices and printers in the control panel so basically let me just show you guys so first you go to control panel devices and printers right click here on uh, vi wireless controller then go to game controller settings and this little box would open and then um, go to properties so now you can test all the buttons so basically here's me moving the right stick here's me moving the left stick pressing all the buttons center button everything works Here's yep that works okay so um, there's much not much in settings but then um, okay so we're gonna press OK now everything's working okay again close this and then we're gonna go to Steam now in Steam we have to open big picture mode now this is gonna open and this is basically a console on your PC. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to um, settings. You're gonna go to uh, controller, and it's gonna say. So I already configured this, but you're, it's gonna say detected controller. Now press that, and then basically you're gonna. It's gonna say. Um, all these primary so you have this little Xbox controller on the left hand side as you can see and that's what um, it's showing you what button that it corresponds to so primary action is button 1 so let's say a primary button let's press X just keep going go back is circle tertiary action is triangle secondary is square now the first time you do it it'll just go through all the buttons so be careful of that and if you don't calibrate it wrong, um, just press escape. Okay, so guide, I just chose the touchpad. Back, I chose, um, I chose share, as you can see in the same thing up there. Start, I chose options. Left stick, click, basically L3, L R3. Left shoulder is um, L1. L R2 and then there's D-pad up, D-pad down, D-pad left and these things and then um, so left stick X you just go um, you move your left stick to the right or the left right left stick Y you move it up and down and or down yeah uh, and same thing for the right stick X and Y and then left trigger same thing you use um, L2 and R2 so this would be L2 and right trigger would be L2 okay so now we we're done um, let's press save and that would be the triangle and let's just type in a name whoops uh, dual shock 4 and let's upload this so there we go, we're done. Um, let me just get into a game to you guys. Let's go to Team Fortress 2. Let's play a game. Alright, so here we are in um, the game, and we're just gonna go um, to Red Team. Let's choose Heavy. And here we are, we're um, using the controller, so here's the d-pad, you can choose whatever you want. Um, let's go kill someone, let's go shoot. Wish I could just move a bit faster. Shouldn't have chosen the heavy. But anyways, um, we're going... Oh, oops, wrong way. 
guess that guy went the wrong way as well. Oh, here we go. We missed that exit completely. Um, you guys can really see how I never play Team Fortress. But anyways, let's go, let's go. Okay, so we're out now, and um, let's find some. Oh, there we go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go flank them. Um, I think that's a spy. That should have been a spy. Anyways. There you go, there we go. Alright. And thank you guys for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. And um, if you have any, like, if you need any help on how to do this, just comment below. Uh, make sure your USB stays connected because the um, it won't just automatically connect with the Bluetooth, uh, unfortunately. Um, anyways, thank you for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe.